Hello, Hi, everybody. everybody. Wow, that is some outfit. I'll have butter brickle in a sugar cone with extra sprinkles, please. I'm glad you're in good humor, <laughs> at any rate. Uh, one of my idols, uh, as both a pianist and vocalist, has got to be the one and only Nat King Cole. Uh, as far as piano singers are concerned, he was the best there ever was. And Lena Horne, whose birthday is coming up on Wednesday, is, as many of you know, a huge idol of mine. Seeing her Broadway show, The Lady and Her Music, was one of the most thrilling theatrical experiences I've ever had. It's ironic that as famous as they both were, we feel that they were also misunderstood. I mean, I think still a lot of folks don't know how important King Cole was to the development of jazz piano. And I think Miss Horn's beauty blinded a lot of people to what a superb singer she was. You know, that's funny because people are always saying that about me. 17 years, just saying. So we've put together a little take out time travel fantasy. They never did a duet as far as we know. So we've created one out of songs that they both recorded. I take requests, Ms. Vizhanel. What'll it be? <laughs> I wanna be happy, but I won't be happy. Till I make you happy too. Life's really worth living when we are mirth given. Why can't I give some to you when skies are gray?